Hey guys, check it out, it's World of Tanks. This game is just so wonderful. It's basically <laughs> it's basically War Thunder Arcade, except I don't know, it, it actually plays significantly differently. And this is actually Maya Noob's... Oh, this is only the second game we've ever played together, and this was, I believe, like the fourth game I've played in probably a year and a half at this point. But I'm going to start playing this game a whole bunch again, because I forgot how much fun it was. And uh, this is the T-18. It is by far one of the most ridiculous tanks in this game. And Noob's driving the FTBS, also, <laughs> which is also quite an amazing little artillery. And uh, we're going to do our best to club the entire enemy team, and I'm typing at the moment, which is... Uh, yeah, wait for it, wait for it. Yeah, just typing in can turn now. So I don't use the derp gun on this tank, and a lot of people get confused. And uh, the reason I called Noob's tank the bullshit is because it's BS. I mean, I mean, who would, who would drive a tank that has BS in the name? It's just ridiculous. You're just begging to have people make jokes at you. And this right here is why I use the not derp gun. That over there is a T-18 who is using the derp gun, and I am using the high rate of fire gun, and I destroyed his cover. I damaged him. I damaged him again, he damaged me a little, and I bounced one, and killed him. That's why I don't use the big howitzer, that's why I use the little sniper gun. Because it works, it works phenomenally well. So that's reason number one, when you run into other T-18s, which is by far the biggest threat to you, you can just rip them apart, because they can only fire once for every three shots. You can fire about, I don't, I don't actually remember the exact number anymore. The other reason I use this gun rather than a derp gun is about to be demonstrated yet again. Wait for it. Wait for it. Hey, there's a little scout tank over there. And ready, about face. Ready, about face. Aim and miss. Darn. And kill him. <laughs> if I had the howitzer, I would have missed the first shot anyway because I forgot to aim. And then after that, I would have not been able to get killed. Oh my goodness, someone shot me. Why would someone shoot me? Oh, oh, cover, cover. Just because this tank has some pretty ridiculous frontal armor does not mean it's that badly overpowered. But look, and more damage, and, and killed him. And look, it's another T-18. There's another T-18 coming towards me. We are about to discover who is the better troll. And I damage him, he bounces. I damage him, he bounces. I kill him and he almost kills me. <laughs> I am the better troll. And this is, that's four kills now. Almost all of which have been almost entirely just me damaging him. And wait, wait, Noob currently has two. Wait for it. Oh, there's only one left. And... Wait for it. There he is. Up, oh, up, oh. and Noob got him! Yay! So Noob, Noob got three, and I got four, and our little platoon together got seven tanks in our second match. I'm not showing you the first match because the first match was terrible. We were both in tier three scout tanks, and we fought a bunch of tier five heavies, and it was, it was, it was what happens when that happens. So I don't, I don't have, a, I forgot to take a screenshot of the results page, but I will have a screenshot of the results page in every World of Tanks video from this point on, with the exception of the next three, which which should be uploaded here pretty quickly. Another one's going to be on the T-18 and how massively overpowered it is, and an even better example of how overpowered it is. Then I have a video about the Panzer II C something, and then I have a, they have two other videos I want to show you in this game that should be up within a day of each other. So there's this game. Yay! It's fantastic. Well, fantastic's a strong word, but it's pretty great. <laughs> Yay, World of Tanks.